An act of kindness comes full circle tonight for a woman who lost her wallet and the man who found it in the mad dash to get out of the gunfire at the Arlington Park Mall shooting. Ken Molestina spoke to them both as they reunited. Hey, how are y'all? Good. How are you, cutie? There's your <laughs> Thank right you there. so okay. much. No problem. Nice oh my gosh. Hugs between new oh, friends and one that. big sigh of relief for Stephanie Mundy. I had my phone, keys, and wallet in my hand. Um, somehow the wallet got knocked out of my hand because there was a big brush of people that just came right through. She says losing her wallet was the least of her worries as shots rang out inside the park small. Absolutely terrifying. All she cared about in that moment was grabbing her son and bolting for the exit. And we ran out the door as fast as we could. It wasn't until hours later that she made a plea on social media. So I posted on Facebook, uh, if anyone picked up a black wallet with diamonds on it, please return it. It was a shot in the dark, but thankfully for her, Mike Benavides and his wife were already trying trying to find the owner of the wallet he picked up as he and his family also ran out of the mall. Man, it was just uh, panic. Everybody just panic. I seen people crying, kids getting knocked over. Mike says as people ran out of the mall, he was able to pick up different things that they left behind when they got out here to the parking lot. He gave it back to their owners, except for Stephanie's wallet. He said if it wasn't for the Facebook post, he would not have known who it belonged to. Now this single mother can rest easy knowing she escaped a scary situation with her son and that her belongings are back home thanks to a good Samaritan. But it definitely shows that, you know, there's definitely good people in the world. In Grand Prairie, Ken Molestina, CBS 11 News. Ken also shared with us while they were talking that the family say their new friendship is a classic case of kind of finding the silver lining in a bad situation. And they do tell us that they plan on keeping in touch in the future. Very nice.